Breaking news. During their journey to the US, Meghan and Harry won't be meeting Kate and William, it is claimed. But before we continue, are you interested in starting or scaling a YouTube channel, without having to show your face or becoming a traditional YouTuber to earn $30,000 a month? Click on the link below for more information. The Fab Four were formerly referred to as the now-separate royal couples. According to recent rumours, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will not be meeting Kate, Princess of Wales, or Prince William on their tour to the US this week. On Wednesday, the Prince and Princess of Wales will fly to Boston, Massachusetts. Prince Harry and Meghan will be in New York for a few hours at that time, having moved there after giving up their royal duties in 2020. Following the passing of their late grandmother, the late Queen Elizabeth II, relations between the two brothers are still reportedly tense despite joint engagements. The couple has harshly criticized the royal family in the US media. Although the distance between the two couples has significantly decreased, according to several sources, there are no arrangements in place for a reunion in the United States. Despite being citizens of California, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are traveling to New York City on December 6 to receive recognition in a lavish event. But the Prince and Princess of Wales have also drawn some inspiration from the Kennedys during their brief three-day visit to the US. This year marks the second anniversary of Prince William's Earthshot Prize, an environmental take on JFK's 1960s Moonshot Initiative. The first awards event took place in October 2021 at Alexandra Palace. The Prince and Princess of Wales are both really eager for the visit, according to a source. They won't have been to the United States since 2014. They feel and appreciate the love and excitement of the American people for their return to the US and are truly looking forward to meeting as many folks as possible, the unnamed source told People. The royal family has recently experienced a bumpy ride in the US, according to Majesty Magazine managing editor Joe Little. Added him, on the heels of The Crown and the Oprah Winfrey interview, which did not reflect especially well on the House of Windsor, they have received a tremendous amount of criticism. So, if at all possible, I think it's a fantastic time to sort of redress the balance while they're in the US, the author said. In another news. As they became closer, the Queen served as Princess Kate's phenomenal tutor. It is reported that the late Queen Elizabeth II was eager to prepare Prince William's wife for life as the King. Kate had the Queen as a phenomenal mentor, according to a royal authority. The late monarch and the Princess of Wales had a tight bond, according to royal author Katie Nicholl. Elizabeth II should make sure the future Queen consort is prepared, according to Ms. Nicholl. The royal expert emphasized how Kate, Prince William, and their kids spent time with the monarch each summer at Balmoral while on vacation. The King's biographer stated, and those were priceless, priceless opportunities for Kate to get to know the Queen well. They did get along well, after all. Mentoring took place as part of that connection, and the Queen was able to impart her wisdom, values, and recommendations. According to Ms. Nicholl, Kate is well prepared for her position thanks to her experience, mentoring, and confidence. She had a wonderful mentor in William, but I think she also had a phenomenal mentor in the Queen, the royal author told OK. Magazine Making ensuring the future Princess of Wales and Queen was ready was very much in the late Elizabeth II's interest. Before Kate and William were married in 2011, Ms. Nicholl claimed that Her Majesty made her ladies-in-waiting available to her so she could speak to them about performing royal engagements. A pearl bracelet, dangling earrings, and the sparkling lover's knot tiara, which once belonged to Princess Diana, finished off her ensemble. To commemorate South African President Cyril Ramaphosa's two-day state visit to the UK, the event was held. Thanks for watching.